Welcome back to the Will Go channel. I'm your host and self-appointed Go Evangelist, James Story. Today's lesson is in the Quick Basics series. We're going to look at how to count a co threat. So we're going to imagine that black just took a co and white wants to retake the co and they play this as a co threat. If black plays here, they get two eyes, don't they? And they will live. If white gets another move in, though, they're going to play this. And now these, this uh, black group will be considered dead at the end of the game because it can only make one eye. So let's look at it here. So black just took the co and white just played this. So let's look first as if black plays this move. How many points will they get? Well, the first thing we do is we count the number of white stones with inside the black group, one, and we multiply by two. And the reason we do that is because black is going to get a point for the stone and then a point for the point of territory under the stone, aren't they? So if there's a lot of stones, it's easier just to count um, uh, the number of stones and multi the white stones and multiply by two. That would give us the number two and then the spaces, the points of territory within the black group, three, four. All right, so white, black will get four points if they play this move here. If white gets to play that move, though, then the black group will be considered dead and black will get, excuse me, white will get points for each of these stones, black stones, points for each, one point for each of the black stones, one point for each of the points of territory underneath the black stones, or in essence, two times the number of black stones. Plus, they'll get this point, won't they? This point, and also these points, even though they were originally Dame points, now they'll fall within White's territory and be counted as White's points. So let's count that. So we came up with four points if Black played here. Black gets four points. Let's see how many points white gets if they play there. There's ten stones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten black stones. So we multiply that by two. And that gives us twenty. And then twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, and twenty-six. And we add that to the number that black would have gotten, four, if black had played here. And that gives us a total of thirty points. So this co-threat is worth that black, white has just made here is a 30-point co-threat. And black can fill the co, but white is going to play here, and they're going to swing by 30 points. It'll be a 30-point point swing. So whatever the co is, I don't know. We don't really have it on this board. Um, but whatever it is worth, it better be worth more than 30 points. Anyway, if you like what you saw today, please give us the thumbs up. Please subscribe. You can find us on Facebook. You can contact us here at the World Go channel at gmail.com. Also, we have a number of playlists, Lessons in a Logical Sequence is the playlist that we suggest for new Go players to the World Go channel. Um, some lessons are based on the lessons in previous, the knowledge in previous lessons, and so the logical sequence is the logical sequence in which to follow them. Anyway, that's uh, to watch them. Anyway, that's, that's it for the World Go channel. We'll see you next time. Goodbye.